What is up, internet? How are you people? Today's video, we're continuing the Ask Reddit list. We had over a hundred submissions and we only had one session before I didn't get to play all hundred plus songs. Today, we're continuing on the list. Let's get straight into the video. chart good song but I'm out of breath DDR song and chart. I mean, it was okay. Sorry, I don't really like your pick. Nothing really going on with it that great. Kind of on the bland side.
Maybe I'm just not a fan of like lower level charts because there's not that much going on. The song's pretty cool. The chart, eh, it was okay. I'm not gonna say it was bad, but it wasn't great either. trying to sound like a Debbie Downer here or anything like that. These songs have been like okay for the most part. Nothing too great about them. Ah yes. Stop it to my business, stop it to my beat you! To my beat you, stop it to my beat! screen. So that's the original chart that I remember. I don't remember a challenge chart for this song. So either I just never played it, was unaware of it, or it's something new because it also looks like it has the new scale system. So let's give it a whirl. <laughs>
played that chart before. Definitely better than the expert chart. The challenge chart seems a lot more fun. But I don't remember that being in BDR. We want you! music video for that song. I just got hit with so much memories. Oh my god. I mean, the song is hilarious. The music video is nostalgic. It's epic. How do I not give this anything but a thumbs up? <laughs> I really have fun playing that. That was awesome. the challenge chart although I think they could have made it a little bit more difficult I'm not sure if it's my favorite song from Supernova I would have to go through that list again but it's definitely in the top three really love the song chart the crazy instruments that's going on I don't know how you pronounce it but it gets a double thumbs up this is awesome I'm gonna grab another water real quick while I'm a little
better score the first time. If I'm not mistaken, I had a blue combo. But your people didn't even get to see it because I'm an idiot. So Xenon is one of my favorite songs in DDR, like as a whole, the series. This is a double thumbs up for sure. One of my favorite songs in DDR. Oh god. I don't have enough energy for this right now. <laughs> first ever FPC on a level 15. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. I don't believe I just got an FPC on that. I give this song, it's gonna sound so biased, I give this song a double thumbs up. I love the song. I love the chart. For hard anyways. I haven't passed the 17. I don't think I'm going to be able to pass it anytime soon, but the hard chart, level 15, epic, freaking awesome. Honestly, I didn't think I was going to have enough energy to clear this, let alone get a full combo, let alone be a perfect full combo. That was freaking awesome. But now we only have round one and Dave and Busters. That's it. Nothing else.
DDR hard charts I've played, especially considering it feels like an older song, early generation DDR. That actually went to the music very nicely. Definitely got to give that a thumbs up. I would play that chart again. If I'm like warming up, feeling a little slow, I'm definitely keeping that chart in mind. That was really fun to play. Another classic. question for anyone watching. Was that the original chart? I haven't played the song in years. Seems like it was a little too difficult to beat the original chart. Did they like take the original chart and bump it down and make a new expert? Or a new hard I should say? Yeah exactly. <laughs> it's funny how I'm saying that. I'm reading the comments. That did not seem like the original chart. <laughs> Could be completely wrong because I haven't played that song in years. I mean it's a classic song. The step chart was harder than I remember, if that was even the original step chart. But that was really fun. Definitely got to give that a thumbs up. Oh god. I am not ready for this right now. <laughs> has to get a double thumbs up it can't really be anything lower this is just my point of view Max 300 is what started the DDR obsession in my heart in my soul of trying to get better because this when I first tried this chart when I first saw people playing this chart it was in my brain impossible <laughs> My cousin had DDR Max for the PlayStation 2, 
and we unlocked this song not on pad we unlocked it using the playstation 2 controller on playstation 2 controller we could not clear it our thumbs would start to get tired and we would have to stop there was no way we could clear it this like opened my eyes to the possibility then of course my favorite is chart favorite is that a word my most favorite chart in ddr my most favorite song was immediately after this one max unlimited that was the song that was like my drug into playing higher level charts because once i cleared that nothing seemed impossible anymore although i haven't cleared a 17 yet max unlimited helped me play songs from like in the groove i think if it wasn't for max 300 and max unlimited i don't think i ever would have cleared like destiny from in the groove this song right here was the eye opener the soul grabber of dragging me into ddr because i always played like three two one stars all those fun songs all those fun charts uh dot 59 try to think of the older ones twilight zone so deep but this was at the time hell <laughs> Unfortunately, I got distracted by the chat, uh, joined in on the conversation, forgot to give a review of this. The song itself, I mean, it's okay. Uh, it's not my personal favorite. The step chart, I'm kind of on the neutral side of it, but then you get like those weird hitting right arrow like eight times in a row for like really no reason like it doesn't go with the music or anything like that in my opinion anyways maybe i'm an idiot but <laughs> i'm just like very neutral about it. i can't say it's thumbs down because there's not really anything bad about it i don't know it's just not my favorite i'll tell you what though that background the like alien people it always creaked me out <laughs> i never liked looking at that when i was younger <laughs> I would say In the Groove 12s were 16s, but that's just me. I guess it would depend on the 12.
Fortunately, my camera got way too hot to continue streaming. So I'll give you guys my review here. This is way too high of BPM, <laughs> too much, too much speed. There was like one side where you had to press left like eight or nine times in a row. I know how you're supposed to do that, but I was not prepared for it at all. High BPM is my weakness. The song sounded fun, but the chart was way out of my league. So I don't even know if it's fair for me to rate it, but I'm gonna give it a neutral for now. Maybe one day if I pass it, I'll update my review. It's not getting a thumbs up, but it's not getting a thumbs down either. Why is this your favorite? <laughs> say this is from like DDR Game Boy because of the pixelated art. <laughs> expecting that difficult of a chart for a Game Boy DDR that makes me like want to go buy a Game Boy get a copy of this and play it <laughs> I mean the song was kind of like hurting my teeth and my ears the step chart for being for the Game Boy Advance or Game Boy Color whatever this came out for that was pretty freaking decent, if you ask me. I'm gonna give that a thumbs up. I really liked that. I enjoyed that. Sorry, could you make the music louder? Yeah, drop the ball.
Just realized I didn't review when I finished the chart. This is a classic DDR song. The chart is kind of bland. It's like a little slow. A lot more could have been done with this chart to match the beat of the song. But back then, I guess they wasn't really worried about that too much. The song itself is pretty cool. I like the beat. I like the do 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 do. I wish the arrows matched that, but that's what we have edits for. And of course I made an edit to this, but on my PS2, <laughs> I don't have access to that anymore. I'm gonna give for the song itself a thumbs up. The step chart is kind of neutral towards thumbs down, I guess. Uh, still it's one of the OG classic DDR songs and I still like it till today, so. Little BTS things you don't really see in the YouTube vlogs. There's a person wiping sweat off of their Elpic or whatever dance pad they have. section there was a lot going on i'm just so exhausted from the 16s and 17 attempts that i can't get full combos anymore i'm playing very bad on so deep i know someone wrote that down cover of a song and I'm just getting it confused.
here goes nothing. I'm sweating so much that face ID doesn't recognize me. I'm not a fan of the score I got. Pretty evil. I was not expecting to clear this at all, to be honest. I actually cleared that just now. That is incredible. I really gotta learn how to stop getting distracted, but 
I thought this chart was really, really fun. Definitely difficult, but I love having the step on the middle to avoid the mines. Um, I'm going to give this chart and song a thumbs up. I really enjoyed playing it. Please stay. chart is awesome as well. I'm just so exhausted. I haven't slept right in a few days. The lack of sleep, heat in the garage, and then almost a two hour stream. Whew, it's not really uh, helping me right now, especially because we're once in a while playing some of the hardest charts I've ever played. Once again, another classic DDR song. Chart has held up decently over the years. Nothing necessarily wrong with it except that jump. That jump might actually be a user error though. That was weird. Uh -huh. 